So we're heading Aloha, off on a, So we're heading off on an early morning adventure. The sun is not risen. And Lainey doesn't know that she's gonna go swim with the dolphin. Oh that's fun though. How's it going? And always when you start with a big burst of aloha, the ocean generally gives it right back to you. So one more time, <laughs> good morning and aloha. Aloha. That's the way. Good work. Oh, sorry about that. So these are our Hawaiian spinner dolphins. And they're the third smallest species in the entire world. So average ones you'll see three to five Seven. feet long. Thank you. And probably about 100 to 150 pounds. But the largest ones you'll see will be a full-grown adult male, which could be about seven feet long, and 180 to 200 pounds. Now, they are called spinner dolphins because they do jump in the air and spin um, when they're a little bit more active. Mm. But these guys are nocturnal feeders, so they feed at night, mm. and then they return to the shore during the daylight to rest. Mm. So at nighttime they go about three to five miles out feeding at depths of 600 to 1,000 feet, mostly on lantern fish and squid. And in the morning, again, they return to the shoreline and rest throughout the day period. So these guys are actually trying to get into a resting state.
One, two, three, go! Uh, but we are here for the scorpion. There's a beautiful fringing reef that goes off of the lava flow. Um, so right close to the lava flow could be about 10 feet deep. And then where we are here is actually over 100 feet. So it does this dramatic drop off. So you get a great diversity of life from the bottom all the way to the top. Uh, we are in the open ocean, so you do want to be very careful with some waves as you see waves breaking along the lava flow. We don't need to go anywhere close to where the waves are breaking. There's reef all underneath where we're going to be gradual slope off into the deep. So you always want to look out into the blue. So you never know what could be out there. We have some of the whale sharks here before, manta rays, eagle rays, turtles, all kinds of stuff. can reach up to 55 feet in length and weigh about a ton per foot. And the first one we sighted this year was in October and the latest I've ever seen one here was July. But the peak season is pretty much December to March, April. Take care, you guys. Good as Kiala, you go with Yeah, thank you.